I'm going to go through the assembly of the Ozlifting Products composite davit crane. As you can see, the crane has been disassembled completely. When we ship it, it's actually partially assembled, but I'd like to go through the complete disassembly and reassembly just so that you can see it in case you do have to disassemble it completely. The first step is we're using a pedestal base. We also offer a socket base, but we're going to use this pedestal base for the demonstration. Notice it's not anchored to the floor. It needs to be in operation, but for our purposes, the crane will stand up just fine. So the first step is we grab the mast section and we set it into the base. And then we're going to set the main boom section across the top of the mast using the smart latch. And that mechanism is pretty easy to use. You hook the one side of the smart latch first and then drop the boom over the top. Now the boom is locked into the top of the mast. We're going to tilt it down just so it's out of the way. On the end of the pins, you'll see that they're actually numbered 1, 2, and 3. And that's referenced in the instructions manual. But we'll also go through the numbers and where the pins go as we do the assembly. In our case, the longest pin, pin number two, is going to go in the top of the boom section. We're going to attach the one end of the ratchet binder. We're going to lock that pin in with a linch pin. Then we're going to grab pin number one to attach the bottom end of the ratchet binder, again with another linch pin. The balance of the crane is so good that you can pretty much hold it just from the end of this ratchet binder. So you use that to line up the bottom holes. We slide that pin in, lock it with our linch pin. Then we're going to put the telescoping section of the boom in the end of the boom. Make sure the labels read right side up so that everything's put together correctly. It just slides in like so. And we use the final pin, pin number three to lock it in place. So now the crane is basically set up, but we also include a handle with it, and the handle can go in two positions depending which is most convenient. The handle can either be slipped over the bottom pin here, and then locked in place with the linchpin if this is a more convenient operation, or you can slide out partially, pin number two, and put the handle up top and lock it in up here. Whichever you use is up to you, whichever is more convenient for your application. And that's the assembly from scratch of the Oz Lifting Products Composite Data Crane.